want to do your share in taking care of our planet and cook delicious meals, stay in this video. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Responsibly get your meals. Hi, I'm Ingrid. Thank you for visiting my cooking channel, The Erlin Fair Cuisine. The mission from now on is to learn more about SDG number 8 of the Sustainable Development Goals. SDG number 8 is decent work and economic growth. All the information related to the SDGs I take it from the United Nations website. To expand this information, I leave the link of the United Nations website in the description box of this video. And now the question I ask you every time I talk about the SDGs. What can I do as a person to help in achieving this SDG number 8 decent work and economic growth in this decade 2020-2030? There are two very easy things we can start doing right now. The first one, let's support small merchants or family businesses in our area with their products to boost the local economic growth. And the second thing, very, very important, it's let's support the market or the products that we know the place of origin, that we know how products are manufactured, and most importantly, that they are environmentally friendly. If you know more ideas of how we can help in achieving this SDG number eight or the rest of the SDGs, please leave a comment. Follow me on Instagram for more ideas of how we can contribute every day to improve the health of our planet. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, click on the bell, like, comment and share. And now let's continue with the recipe. Vegan potato puree as a main dish. Mashed potatoes as a main dish. Here are the ingredients for two servings. One pound of potatoes, half cup finely chopped red bell peppers, one cup of medium diced mushrooms, half cup of textured soy protein, one quarter cup of soy sauce, green onion, cilantro finely chopped, dried onion or fresh onion, olive oil, paprika, salt and pepper. Peel and quarter potatoes, then cook them with enough water to cover them and add some salt. Hydrate the soy protein with a quarter cup of soy sauce and after potatoes have boiled for approximately 10 minutes, start sauteing the red bell peppers with the fresh onion and a tablespoon of olive oil and some salt. If you have dried onions instead, you can add half tablespoon of dried onions instead of fresh onions along with the hydrated soy protein and some paprika or the spices of your preference mix well then add the mushrooms cut the mushrooms in medium sized cubes approximately mix well cover and saute for three minutes if you lack a little juice in the sauce you can add 2 tablespoons of water from the cooking of the potatoes. Let it sauté for 30 more seconds and then remove from the heat. Check the potatoes if they are soft, remove them from the heat and drain them. Leave about half cup of the cooking water from the potatoes or add half cup of plant-based milk and add 1 tablespoon of vegetable butter. Now proceed to mash the potatoes with a masher or with a fork. Add some chopped cilantro or parsley and mix well into the puree. Potatoes are such a comfort food and thanks to whomever invented mashed potatoes. It's my favorite uh, version of potatoes. Okay, dinner's ready. Serve the puree into two plates or two bowls and form a little bed and then pour the saute protein and saute mushroom sauce on top of the puree. Sprinkle some chopped green onions on top of the puree and optional, you can enrich this dinner or lunch with some seeds, seeds of your preference. I added some pistachios. I think um, this was going to go well with this dish. In the link above, you find a recipe for baked cauliflower 
subscribe and remember to click on the bell to be the first one in receiving these easy and delicious recipes. Enjoy your meal! Thanks for watching this video until the end. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. Like, comment and share. And I hope you are reducing, separating and cleaning the solid waste you generate in your house. Bye-bye.